Every year, April and May marks the beginning of a special season everyone looks forward to. No, we aren't talking about spring, we are talking about prom season. And we have all the tips to help you survive your big promposal. Before we jump into it, be sure you're subscribed to The Taco for more awesome prom tips. For now, let's take a look at 10 tips for asking out your prom date. Talk to their friends. Remember that Spice Girls song that told guys they had to get with their friends if they wanted to be their lovers? Well, if you are in high school right now, probably not, but there is still something you can learn from the 90s song. If you want to know about your potential prom date, you should talk to their friends. This is especially true if you want to figure out if they've already been asked. Your crush's friends are a great resource when it comes to asking them to prom. There's a pretty good chance they will know whether or not your crush likes you, and they will even know certain insights, like their favorite color, that will make it easier for you to ask them to prom. Leave their parents out of it. Thanks to the trend of promposals, you might have to ask permission for certain over-the-top antics. That being said, you shouldn't do anything that you'd have to get her parents' permission. When it comes to their love lives, teens would rather their parents stay out of it. Plus, why would you want to take the chance of them saying no? You should also try not to ask them in front of their parents. Think of how you would feel if your parents were around. It's probably a little embarrassing, right? So why would you do that to your potential prom date? Your parents will be doting on both of you on prom night, so save the promposal for you and that special someone. When to do it. Okay, so there is a big factor you have to think about before asking your crush to prom, and that's when to actually do it. First, you have to make sure they don't have a date already, which means you should be the first to ask them. The later you wait, the slimmer your chances will be. It's a good rule of thumb to ask your crush about a month before your actual prom. Why so soon? Well, as we said, you want to be the first, but that's not the only reason. There is a lot of planning that goes into prom night. That means you'll want to leave your date enough time to find something to wear, and you will need enough time to actually plan the date. Be romantic. If you are asking someone to prom that you have romantic feelings for, then you better show it. There is a theme of grand gestures when it comes to asking girls to prom, and there's a good reason. They work. We all know that most girls love romantic movies, and what do all these movies have in common? It's the fact that someone in the main relationship will pull a grand gesture to prove their love for the other. You can do something as simple as writing a poem, or something more elaborate using stuffed animals. But no matter what you do, if you are romantic and heartfelt, there's a good chance you'll score yourself a prom date with your crush. Get creative. It should go without saying that you'll need to get creative with your promposal. The more creative and unique it is, the better your chances will be that she'll say yes. It's always a good idea to keep it light and have a sense of humor. Are you great with funny puns? Fantastic! Try to find a way to incorporate that creativity into an awesome promposal. Girls love feeling special, so taking the time to do something that hasn't been done before will score major points. Plus, if you can make her laugh, she'll melt in your hands quicker than chocolate. Don't put them on the spot. Unless the person you are asking to prom is your significant other, don't do a public promposal. There is nothing more embarrassing than having to say no to someone in front of other people. Oh wait, there is. Being rejected in front of other people is what nightmares are made of. Not to mention the fact that you might actually pressure them to say yes because the crowd is encouraging them. Wouldn't you rather take a date to prom who sincerely wants to go with you? If so, do something sweet and personal and leave the public promposals to the Instagram official sweethearts. Find inspo online. Okay, we all know it's tough to be creative, especially in a high stakes situation like a promposal. But don't fret, because you have one of the greatest tools on the planet in your arsenal the internet. If you are stuck in a promposal rut, then use sites like Pinterest or BuzzFeed to see what current trends are. You'll be able to see what others have done to get their prom date, and hopefully, that will inspire some creativity on your end. This is also a great way to see what has already been done so you can steer clear of being unoriginal. Don't do it over text. If there is one tip you should take away from this video, it's this one. Don't ask your crush to prom over text message. Yes, we live in an age where technology makes it easier to ask the hard questions, like asking someone to prom, but that doesn't mean you should. There is nothing more lazy, less creative, and unromantic than asking your crush to prom over text. If this lackluster promposal is any indication of the effort you'll put into planning the date, then expect a swift rejection. And ladies, if a guy asks you to prom via text message, just say no. You deserve better. Just relax. Since we've taken text message promposals out of the equation, that means you'll have to ask your crush to prom in person. This is a pretty stressful task, to say the least. 
Chances are, you'll have a lot of anxiety as you anticipate their answer. But at the end of the day, just relax. The worst thing that will happen is that they will say no, which isn't even a big deal in the grand scheme of things. Though you'll want to go with someone you like or will have fun with, in 20 years, it won't really matter who you took to prom. So take the pressure off yourself and don't take it too seriously. Have a backup plan. That being said, you should always have a backup plan for your promposal. What if they say no? What will you do? Well, depending on your promposal, you could come up with a creative way to react to their rejection. You should always make your crush feel okay about their decision. Don't blast them on social media or try to be mean. If they don't want to go with you, that's their loss. You can always go with a friend, which would probably be more fun anyway. Either way, make a backup plan. That way, you can still enjoy your prom night regardless of who you take. Do you have any tips for asking out a prom date? Share them in the comments section below. And don't forget to subscribe to The Taco. Thanks for watching.